Hi, my name is Erica. My name is Erica Beckford, and I'm from Mount Bay. All right, I'm here to represent the people of the Mount Bay Division. We are here seeking for our representative. We want a representative right now. We want someone to who can speak to, and there is no representative. So that is one of the main reasons why we, we are here. We want by election to be called so we can have a representative to, to for the person people them can really voice their, their 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 concern. It's now back to school and there's nobody to talk to. All right, so we are right, we are here today. We are here today just to ask the, the, the minister, please call the by election. So the Marty Bay Division can have a representative. So the people can voice their concern. Thank you. Okay. All right. My name is Leroy Pashley. Um, from Eastern St. Thomas in Morant Bay. We're here this morning to state a peaceful demonstration with some situations that has been happening in the Morant Bay space and political division. And those situations would have to deal with our by-election that should have been held weeks ago. And we are saying that the people of Morant Bay Division needs representation. And to have a by-election being pushed back from the time it is supposed to have been held, it becomes a problem to the citizens of Morant Bay. And the reason for saying that is... We have seen work, political work, has been done. We have seen gullies being cleaned. We have seen even the roundabout being cut, being trimmed. And none of the, the persons of the other side, which is the People's National Party, has been privileged to get any work in this situation. And this is political um, victimization. We believe that if work is going to be done, every person should get their fair share. All right? And we are, we are saying to the mayor and the powers that be, Please act in the capacity in which you should be acting. Please don't allow persons to be looking and expecting something and you're not privileging them to get what belongs to them. It's back to school and everybody wants to look how slim. Right now, we are saying even to Desmond McKenzie, are you this week that you want to tell me that one division in a constituency should have a by-election and you're pushing it back for three months? We are seeing where the candidate for the Jamaica Labour Party is being given funding to spend. And we don't know, if we, we can't stop that. But we are saying, if you are giving him funds to spend, allow the PNP to also presentation. And if they don't have a political representation, it is hard for them to even get a chance to do the things that they need to do. Unless they have somebody who they can call on and depend on, they are unable to, to perform or to even get a chance to, 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 to exist among those who of the, of, of, of the person on their side, like the mayor. The mayor is a, is a Labour Party mayor. And I think, I think we are unbalanced in how we are carrying out the duties right now. And that's what we are saying here today. We are asking that Desmond McKenzie, the minister, do not push back this by-election. Call the by-election and allow the citizens of the town of this constituency to choose who they want to represent them. That's all we are asking for. What is hard in that? Um, Come and watch us died from the first of May. Why is it that a by election cannot be held? What, 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 are they, what, what are they afraid of? Why they refuse to call a by election? Are you afraid of something? Come on, just call election. You are in power. You have the power. Call the election. Stop putting off the election and allowing the people of this division to suffer more than they are suffering already because they have been shoved aside and not been privileged to get work or anything, any benefit at all, politically. So we are saying, call the by-election and allow the people to get representation. That's all we are asking for. My question here, I remember a few weeks ago you had a stages in the process. Yes. Uh, was your questions answered then? No. Our questions are still left hanging in the balance because we have not been privy to any form of information that anything has changed. However, we have seen where the, 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 the minister has taken a document to parliament um, seeking the right to, 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 to push back the election, which makes no sense because Mark is, is one single division in a humongous constituency. How can one division affect nationally? 
What are you afraid of as a minister to call an election? To call a by-election? When you, when you keep the by-election not being held, you keep the people in a, a, a state of horror, punishment. It's that they don't have nobody to talk to because, you know, the comments will not come to speak to the, to the Labour, Labour uh, mayor because they have the belief that they will not be given the justice that they are deserving. And this is why we are having this peaceful demonstration so that the, the light can be shed so we can get the privilege of having this election. The face come like you are two egg a carry. You see that one here? Dangerous. And you are ducky. You see the next one? I don't know what happened to you. No water now can hold you. You have a wash way this time. Wash way. Out of center, man. And the next thing, we are getting rid of you and your child's them. We don't want them back in our center, man. Don't go there. No.